this is Gary with your cards of the day and uh, today this is slightly unusual I have five cards out for you and that's because while I was um, shuffling my first deck which is the Juliet Charlotte Burke and Giovanni Caselli new mythic tarot we had a jumper card so let's start with that one and what we have is the six of cups now this card is all about looking back nostalgia reminiscing really it's looking back into the past looking back at your emotions at what worked at what didn't work perhaps at things that emotionally that you've lost and it really is a card of looking into the past uh, today so I feel and I know this is very true because this has been happening with me today already so I'm sure there are other people out there who are feeling the same and they're looking back at old situations today now your second card is the four five even of wands now what I'm really drawn to with this card is the two figures in the front the hero and his lady looking at the golden fleece in the background and anyone who's familiar with the film Jason and the Argonauts will have, will know this story our two heroes have got their eyes on the prize but they can't get to it because they're blocked by this fire breathing creature which in the film was actually a hydra but here it does look more like a dragon so this makes me feel like what we've got is uh, things that we want to be getting on with and um, ideas even because this is the card of uh, this is the suit of wands uh, that we feel blocked we feel unable to get them done get them down and this also is very true today as I'm having to re-record this video a few times so our third card is the two of rods now rods in this deck is equivalent to wands or staves um, in um, other decks and what I'm really drawn to here is this is about choice there's two options really there's the figure crouching and there's also the lady who is in a very sort of dancing pose really and she's carrying the two staffs uh, in her hands and it makes me feel we have a, a choice how we react today do we curl up in a ball do we crouch and hide or do we get up and really get on with things and you know make it happen so this is to me is a card of choosing how to act today our third card is from the sacred circle and this is rebirth now this is roughly equivalent to the judgment card in other decks and what this is making me feel is that what we're dealing with here is a real sort of revelation change of attitude um, you could almost look at it as a paradigm shift I actually do see one other card as being a paradigm shift card and that's the tower but while the tower comes from a place of hardship I feel that the rebirth or the judgment card comes from a place of uh, perhaps divine guidance and certainly a gentler place and this is that sort of energy we're also I'm very drawn to the Sun blasting out from the middle of this card giving us its energy as much to say yes you have the energy and you have the ability to do the things that you want this is a real card of revelation for me today and uh, it does make me feel that a change of attitude and change of mind set will really be beneficial and then the final card which is our rune card is Gwyn which is sometimes called Wunjo and if I bring this really close you can see the character on the card looks very much like the letter P now Gwyn is about success and victory it's a really happy rune to draw actually and what we have here is a celebration and we have a family scene where the figure in the center is celebrating and he has all the people who mean something to him around him 
So my feeling with this is that after all the journey and the trials and the tribulations of the day, we have that success, we have that family time, that celebration, could possibly be with friends as well, to say yes, even after everything we've gone through, we've made it, we've done it today. So if we look at these five cards now, we have the card of looking into the past, of reminiscing. We have the card of blocks and not being able to move forward, perhaps because of the reminiscing, in fact. That itself could act as a block. Um, we also have uh, a thing with, with this card as well, which is perhaps we're blocking ourselves. And what we have is fire blocking fire in this card. We have the card of choosing how to act. Do we cower and, in a sense, surrender? Or do we act in a more fiery and determined kind of way? Do we get on with things? We have the card of revelation, which gives us an insight and a change of mindset. And we have, ultimately, the card of success and joy and victory which enables us to end the day feeling like it's been a successful day even though it may have been quite hard well that's your cards for today i hope you've enjoyed them as always um please drop me a few comments and if you have a particular deck of your own that you enjoy do feel free to suggest it to me i'd like to wish everyone a really happy day in whatever it is that you do and blessings and love and light to all.